Hello guys. All right, today we will be fixing a disabled iPad. So I have here an iPad that is disabled right here. So it says here iPad is disabled. Try in 34 minutes. Usually when you enter the wrong password multiple times, your iPad will be disabled. To continue the attempts to unlock your iPad will ultimately lead to a permanently disabled the iPad and you will get a notification iPad is disabled and you have to connect to iTunes. As a result, you won't be able to access your device. So that's a problem. Thus, to again add access to the iPad, you will require some kind of effective solution. What we are going to do now. So we will hook up the iPad to the MacBook and launch the items all right guys so we will be hooking up the ipad to the computer so i have the cable here all right what we're gonna do is So if you are using a MacBook and you don't have this kind of USB, I will require you to buy this USB. It's a Type-C USB and then you can just hook up the cable in there and then hook up in here. All right, already hook up. So, okay. Okay, an accessory to connect. Okay, so what we're gonna do is um, hold the power button and the home button together. Okay, all right, wait until the dark screen. And now we will again for the Apple logo. So it's the Okay, it says there, connect to iTunes, okay? So, we have a message on the computer. It says here, allow accessory to connect. So this is the iTunes. This is the recovery mode. So we just click allow. Okay, so this is the iPad. Let me just leave the iPad in there. So we'll get it closer to the computer. So it says here, there is a problem with the iPad that requires to be updated or restored so what we're gonna do is click restore okay it says here are you sure you want to restore the ipad to its factory settings that means that the ipad whatever you have inside like the passwords pictures and all the all the data will be erased so that's okay so we will click restore and update. There you go. And then it says their iOS 9.3.5 provides an important security update for you. So the iPad will be now become a new, like a brand new. So the iOS will be updated also. So we just need to click next. So you go. So yes, you just need to read all what's in here. So blah, 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 blah. So here we click agree. All right, so it says here your Mac is downloading, downloading the software for this iPad and will restore your iPad when the download is complete. So it will take like 20 or 30 minutes, so we have to wait for that. So now as you can see, it's almost there. Your Mac is restoring the software. See the iPad, look at that. So the Mac is restoring the software to the iPad. That's a good thing. All right, leave that one in there. And wait until it's finished. 
we're almost there we're almost there see that now it's verifying the ipad software see almost there let's go come on all right so your ipad has been restored to factory settings so yes okay we'll be restarting soon that's it okay Come on, almost there. Come on. All right. What's next? What now? Oh, there you go. Oh my God. Okay. Now we can unplug it now. Unplug it. Okay. Now we have now a brand new iPad.